Hi, Dr. Jared. Happy Monday. And this is actually my Friday flop that I had not shared yet. Uh, but today's tip is on silver diamine fluoride. Uh, here you can see some small carous lesions on the mandibular primary first molars, L and S. Uh, we attempted to treat this young individual with some laughing gas and minimal sedation. Didn't end up working out. Uh, we gave the parents the options of going ahead and doing a hall crown or SDF. Uh, we went ahead with the SDF, did two applications, and then put her on a three-month recall to have some social visits to get her comfortable. Unfortunately, at the next time we got x-rays, things got a little bit bigger, and that's just because of the things that the kids are eating. This case could be successfully treated with SDF, but there's going to have to be a diet change at home because we know silver diamine fluoride does not work as well on occlusal surfaces and interproximal lesions. So it's really hard for this to work well when their kids are eating the junk food, the crackers, the chips, the gummies, and it's sticking in all these uh, grooves of the teeth and interproximal spaces. So they're definitely, it can work, but you have to have buy-in at home. We ended up, we're able to do two fillings on this child afterwards with our social uh, program to get them comfortable at the office. So hope this helps. Uh, if you have an occlusal lesion, definitely consider using SDF and putting a glass on or over it so you're not getting a food infection. Have a great week.